let's get into the meat of of the main uh, course of, of boxing. So we know the fans want to hear some boxing talk. So there was a fight over across the pond between Josh Taylor and Jack Catterall. A lot of observers felt like Jack Catterall was robbed in this fight against Josh Taylor. But nonetheless, no matter how we slice it, the champion prevailed and he retains all of his 140 pound straps. So Q, tell me, bruh, if you are waking up and you are Josh Taylor, what is your next move now? I mean, people could cry all day long about a robbery, but you know that's boxing. But it all boils down now to what is Josh Taylor going to do? What would you do if you were Josh Taylor? Do you rematch Jack Catterall with him being uh, where he really was just a mandatory? Do you move on to another fight? What is your move, bro, if you're, if you're Josh Taylor? Only he knows. Um, only he knows he was inside the ring as far as his preparation for the fight. If he if it's some things that he that some some miscues and everything, but um, I I personally I probably want to run that back. I think he could clean it up because I just feel like uh, it's a big money fight. You know what I'm saying? It's a big money fight over in the UK. Two two, uh, two, two sons of the UK. And, um, the people will want to see that fight again and they put some respect on his name. Um, because uh, you definitely don't want to run up on Buzz Bud Crawford after that. You know what I'm saying? That ain't what you want. Um, so I feel like he should run that fight back because he was out. He was outlanded. You know what I'm saying? I think it might have been one stat where he might have he might have slight like body punches. Might have been 31 percent uh, Josh Taylor and 30 percent Catterall. But everything else, it was it was a wider margin and he was outlanded and he finished stronger. But he lost too many points early early in the fight and it, it was a difficult fight to score. It was a lot going on. There was a whole lot going on in that fight. And, um, but I feel like he should run that back, man. That would be the honorable thing to do. Because even I saw Cal, Carl Franklin said, uh, you know, both of the guys are his friend. But he, he got to be honest. He was like, man, the wrong man won his fight. You he said, what saying? were they seeing? He said, what were the refs seeing? What were they seeing? Yeah. I mean, it, it was <laughs> widely, widely disputed as a robbery. You know what I'm saying? You know, but, you know, like I said, as boxing, and, you know, the champ, you got to beat beat the champ. And I feel like he did enough. But, uh, you know, it's one of them things, man. But uh, I feel like he should run that back. I want to run that back, Files him. You know what you got, brother? How oh yeah, I, I, I agree. I, I agree with you a thousand percent, bro. I think that um, I, I'm gonna give a shout out to uh, none other than you know the Bronze Bomber Deontay Wilder, because yeah, a lot of people remember when you know he beat King Kong Ortiz one time, and a lot oh, of man. people were like, "Oh man, that was tough. He almost had you out of there." And Deontay Wilder said, "You know what? To remove all doubt." Let's do it again. <laughs> and he did it again. And, and they almost so had him out of there again. It's been, <laughs> right. You know, you know, Tyson Fury, you know, That's a number normal. of fighters have pulled the move where there's been a controversial fight and they fight a fighter again. And so I agree with you a percent, man. I think Josh Taylor should try to remove all doubt because after that performance, oh, nah, he don't want no smoke with Bud. I think that loses, his performance loses all the luster that, a Bud versus Taylor fight would have would have had because a lot of people would now expect Bud to go in there and just blast Josh Taylor up out of there and that it wouldn't be competitive. So probably the best thing for his career is to run it back with Jack Catterall and then, you know, go ahead and see if you can decisively get that victory and remove all doubt out of fans' minds. So no doubt. That, that's that's kind of what, what, what I feel should happen. But 